know it's just a black screen now, but I'm working on it. I gotta figure this out, dude. Get it all figured out. Let me make sure that's muted also. Excellent. I've set everything up differently. So that's only like New microphone. So we need, we need ten bars I can see chat score. even when I'm playing a game on chat. PC. Excellent. Green. Yeah, beautiful. Uh, but I also realize I'm playing a game that's Revolution is not uh, not made for this. And I don't think I can change it. Uh, no, wait. Uh, yeah, I, I, yeah, okay, never mind. I, I can change the resolution. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. We got it. chips dude um together. It's fine. There we go. Don't crash, Oblivion. Don't crash. Don't crash. It crashed. It crashed. Okay. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Alt-tabbing out creates uh, some trouble. But now I th what? Did you get in there? Yeah. Oh. I know, dude. Oblivion crashing. Mercy, hello. Oh, your colors are different. That's weird. They're different for everyone. That's crazy. Okay, I didn't know that. Did it at least save the settings? It looks, it looks good. That looks good. What's this doing? It's not doing well, is it? Oh, crud. Why isn't it working now? Now! I thought we had it. I thought we were there, dude. Thought we were in. Never mind. Dang it. There's the crash. You don't have to find a thing for it, okay? Yep, yep. <laughs> Definitely a Bethesda game. Oh gosh. Okay, come on.
Give me something. Oh. It's working. <laughs> Guys, I think... I think it's working. I think we got it. I think it's time, dude. Level one run, that's right. That is right. Full level one. Um, and I'll lay out the uh, <laughs> dark and full of crash. Yeah, man. Uh, full level one. Uh, detail all the problems with that I and all of my solutions. Years ago. For and 65 we're doing years, I've ruled as Tamriel's emperor. But for all these years, I've never been the ruler of my own dreams. I have seen the gates of oblivion, beyond which no waking eye may see. Behold, in darkness, a doom sweeps the land. This is the 27th of Last Seed, the year of Akatosh 433. These are the closing days of the Third Era, and the final hours of my life. Oh yeah, it really takes you back, doesn't it? Ah, oh. wow. That song, that, that's this song. My fucking childhood right here. Oh yeah, <laughs> the great quality on children, dude. Love that. <laughs> we have one fallen. Uh, back when, uh, back when Elite was just, was just making its first spaceship. And they had to mirror it so it didn't take up too much space on a hard drive. <laughs> All right. Now, I'm probably going to be playing my favorite race. And it's almost Argonian. It's almost. I did like Argonian for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah. You ought to see the beards in this game, man. <laughs> the beards are something else. Uh, the true enemy of all the myrrh. It's a Breton. Got got the sweet magic resistance. It's gonna be, uh... Oh, shoot. Is it? Ah, uh, no! Uh-oh. That's a problem. Um... But I do appreciate the input. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna just do a quick, a quick alt tab to lower the game. No, no, no. I'll turn down the master volume once we get in. I could do it from here. It's actually kind of amazing, really. There we go. We'll see how. <laughs> we'll see how this goes. Uh. Yeah, dude. What a character editor we've got here, man. I mean, you can do so many things. Uh, like, look at all these things you can do, man. <laughs> oh, God. This is a wild time, dude. Yeah, you know what? I don't think he's got enough nose, really. Come on. Yeah, there it is. Oh, God. God, all the sliders move all the other sliders. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh. Christ. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Don't worry, guys. I'm just Italian. <laughs> He's allowed uh. to say that, by the way. <laughs> yeah, that's allowed, guys. That's allowed. Uh, part Italian. Uh, part <laughs> <laughs> You've got Italian oh, gosh. He's even been to Italy. Yeah. He knows. He's been there. He knows. He's been around. Get it? 
He knows, dude. He knows. Okay, let's. That's a good question. You know what? You're asking the hard hitters right now. I. Oh, oh gosh. We just make him have no nose, dude. Ugh. That. Oh, dude. That's how they made the ghouls from Fallout. That's this is it. <laughs> oh wow. This is horrible. <laughs> All right. Well, let's 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 give him a beard. Let's give him a, a terrible terrible beard. Where is it? It takes a significant drag and then it breaks. Can you even where's where's the beard at? Where's the tone? There it is. Here we go. Let's make it a real dark. This is the beard. That's how you Ah, uh, that is, that is that, oh my god. <laughs> it just changes the shading on the whole face, too. It's not even, ugh, god, ugh, god. Ugh, <sighs> yeah, um. So the character creator is what they is what they were forced to use for all the characters in the game. Um, so in order to actually make uh, Shea Gorath, who has a beard, he is his own race. Uh, <laughs> as nightmarish as that is, I'm gonna go like a like a. Yeah, we. I can go like a white, whitish gray. I'm getting a little old. That's that's blonde. I don't know how to make whitish gray. That's that's gray. That's pretty good gray color. I'm getting a little older. There it is. There we go. Good good enough. Yeah. Wait. Whoop. Does it just cycle through? Is this not okay? Yeah, that works. Good enough. Yeah, thank goodness I don't have to look at the. You kind of do every time you go in the menu. It shows your character, <laughs> but we're gonna put on a helmet, so it's fine. <laughs> oh, oh, geez. All right, it's gonna be Watson because Codex is my actual leveled character make him a little older a little more complex that's fine Th this, this is a fine age good enough but yeah um Shea Gorath's his own race just so they could give him a beard good stuff ah excellent oh Oh, here, hold on. Subtitles too loud. Let me do that, maybe. And then, uh, can I? Yeah, I can do general subtitles. Good, good stuff. Oh, you'll also notice that I have all of the auto saves turned off. That's because, um, it, this is vanilla. I'm not playing with any of the, um. <laughs> yeah, dude, you could. You can tell from him shape shifting. <laughs> um, so, uh, oh, and we're keeping the difficulty at medium here. You may notice I have all the saves turned off. Uh, all the auto save systems in this uh, brick your game. <laughs> um, so, so we're just not gonna use them. Hmm. Nothing but a bunch of stuck-up snobs with cheap parlor tricks. Hey, Go ahead. There it is. Try your magic. Let's see you make those bars disappear. No? What's the matter? Not so powerful now, are you, Gretton? You're not leaving this prison till they throw your body in the lake. Oh, that's right. You're going to die in here, Gretton. You're going to die. Wow. What a, what a stand-up guy. The guards are coming. For you. <laughs> Man. Yeah, special 
M- MC Autumn in the house, baby. <laughs> Uh, the messenger only said they were attacked. No, yeah. I know it. My job oh. right now is to get you to safety. What's this prisoner doing here? This cell is supposed to be off limits. The usual mix up with the watch. I never mind. Get that gate open. Stand back, prisoner. We won't hesitate to kill you if you get in our way. All right, you, prisoner, stand aside over by the window. Stay on. Oh, uh, yeah, you won't get hurt. Stay put, prisoner. Good. Let's go. We're not out of this yet. You. Right. I've seen you. Let me see your face. You are the one from my dreams. Then the stars were right. And this is the day. Gods give me strength. Oh, buddy. Assassins attack my sons, and I am next. My blades are leading me out of the city along a secret escape route. By chance, the entrance to that escape route leads through your cell. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> Patrick Stewart. I am your emperor, Uriel Septim. By the grace of the gods, I serve <laughs> Tamriel as her ruler. You were a citizen. Of <laughs> Looks like he drowned in the bathtub a couple days ago and then forgot about it and <laughs> went back to, honestly. <laughs> oh my god. Perhaps the gods have placed you here so that we may meet. Uh. As for what you have done, it does not matter. <laughs> that is not what you will be remembered for. <sighs> You will find your own path. Take care. There will be blood and death before the end. He very much yes, is sir, we must keep one wrinkly old man, dude. But look at the drip. My God. I'd wear those robes if they weren't so, like, actually sharp. Ugh. <laughs> uh. Okay, come on. Let's let's get this parade moving, guys. Is there a friggin' torch? No. Don't Nothing try in here. I'm oh, watching. hush. Don't get too close. I'll be fine. <laughs> Take out the blades. Hand to hand time, baby. Close up left. Oh shit. Okay. Well, I'm out of here. Protect the yeah, yeah. Like how you just pull out a sword and do nothing with it. Good, uh, good tactics. I mean, I don't even have a sword. All right. I don't want any of that. There you are. All right. Cool. How could they be waiting for us here? Don't know, but it's too late to go back now. There's trouble. Yeah, one of the real challenges is going to be the fact that all these stats are staying the exact same. Good stuff. And also, what am I going to put as my major skills, which I never use? I'm planning on playing a lot of magic, and um, that means I will start with no spells. Uh, which is unfortunate. Don't worry, son. We will get you all right. They won't be the first to underestimate the blades. I'll take point. Let's move. Glenn Stay Roy. in prison. Don't try to follow him. Good old Boris, dude. Yeah, I won't follow you. I guess he didn't notice the fucking rats before he left, no? Okay, that's fine. Don't need to. Don't even worry about it. No, oh, I sure don't have any lock picks, do I? In fact, I won't be picking that lock in general because I won't be picking locks. Oh god, but... Let me tell you, 
what was fan fucking tastic when I was but a child. All right. Yeah, yeah, I know. Being able to practice, stupid, to practice with this bow and shoot that bucket and it flying around and then being able to get your arrow back from this stupid bucket. Ugh. How fucking cool. And now I'm going to drop these two things because I don't need them. Yeah, just give me the key. Ah, uh, I don't need lock picks. I'm gonna get alteration spells that open any lock in the game. <laughs> Screw that lock picking mini game. Stealth Archer. Dude, always fall back to Stealth Archer. We'll pick up the lock picks. Maybe I'll sell them eventually. Yeah, yeah. Click up. The, click on the spells. I know how to cast a spell. Sick. Got the destruction spell up. Yeah, yeah. That's gonna be unfortunate until I get uh, until I get to the point where my spells cost basically nothing. That's gonna be a problem. My willpower being so low. Although my willpower and intelligence start fairly decent as a Breton, and I get an extra fifty mana. Yeah. Ha! Underestimating the blades and one of them actually dies to level one with no armor. I will do this one lockpick just because I do kind of like the minigame. It's kind of, it's, it's kind of fun. But it's much easier to just use alteration to do it for me. And I have to be careful with what skills I am using because I'm never doing that stupid fucking god awful speechcraft minigame. Let me tell you. There was heavy armor back there that I didn't pick up or put on. That wasn't smart of me. Shoot. I forget where it was. Was it in this chest? No, that would have been. That would have been pretty swell. Also, as a mage, I am going to have a tough time keeping track of spells. Yeah, the Speechcraft minigame is such garbage, dude. Like, ah, uh, just let me say the stuff, man. No one, no one, uh There's never a time where it's like, oh, wow. It's so cool that I have to do this little speechcraft minigame for someone like... I'd rather just do a quest to... or, or s anything. Sell them something for, like, next to nothing. Anything to raise their disposition. Other than playing that stupid speechcraft minigame. Yeah, yeah. Just give me a little stomach poke. It, it honestly... <laughs> it honestly looks like I'm... seppuku-ing. I don't think that's a verb, but I made it a verb. It's fine. Oh. Nope. Some other small level one uh, problems are money, but I mean, it's not that hard to break the economy. It's a Bethesda game. But I think I'm going to do... Uh, I think I'm gonna go talk to Dorian in Talus Plaza. I think, uh... I think that, uh, I think that might be the route I'm going for this. <laughs> Just cause it's quick, and I can show that off.
Yeah, so I I don't know if I yeah, give me that ruby. I don't know. I like I can't name one. I can't name a good speechcraft minigame. But I know there are some that it's like, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, I can hotkey stuff. I probably will later when I remember to do that. Let's get a move on, dude. Letix, I am not sneaking. No, thank you. Sneak is not gonna be one of my deals. Goodbye, goblin. Get wrecked. Take your lockpicks just because they're free and might give me some money. I'm not gonna use alchemy either. Because I don't feel like it. Dang. Get out of here. Because I'm going to need a lot of money. And I'm going to have to buy... Uh, in order to just do the... Um, eh, whatever. It's very easy. I don't have alteration yet. Honestly, even with medium high alteration I should be able to unlock most of the stuff since it levels alongside you um, shouldn't be too bad I know it, it like it's got that it's got that old charm to it ah uh, I don't know man whoops Wrong spell, on the wrong spell, but that's fine. Dang. Didn't stagger me when he even blocked. Wild. That's true. A lot of a lot of independent games um, really uh, really put some care into their into their mini games. I love I love to see that. Oh well, I don't know who sees me, but that's fine. Give me that repair hammer. Ah, uh, I gotta figure out if I want to do armor or not. I like armor a lot. Yeah. There you are. I was wondering who saw me. You have a staff I could sell for good money. Well, both of our aim is just on point, dude. Yeah, I'm gonna need a lot of money, because I gotta get Frostcrag Spire. Um, the sweet, sweet mage's house. It is a pretty awesome crib. And then, I can make my own spells after I upgrade it enough. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Dude. Uh, that would probably be me. I, I... Help has arrived. Oh, whoops. Yeah, I'll let you guys take care of it. I, I, I won't underestimate the blades. That's for sure. Damn it! It's that prisoner again. Kip. Oh no. no! The line was killing. By the way. He can help us. He must help us. <laughs> they cannot understand why I trust you. They've not seen what I've seen. How can I explain? Listen, you know the Nine, how they guide our fates with an invisible hand. Uh, I mean, I was in jail, like, I don't know. 
I've served the nine all my days, and I chart my course by the cycles of the heavens. The skies are marked with numberless sparks, each a fire, and every one a sign. I know these stars well, and I wonder which sign marked your birth. This one I actually haven't put a lot of thought into. Um, I might have to look through them real quick. Uh, a lot of these are just um, bonus stats. Uh, I probably won't do any powers because although powers are actually pretty good um, at low levels, uh, once I get to high skill levels, I can basically cast a spell that does all the powers um, pretty, pretty easily. Uh, and I am not doing that. Fuck uh, that nonsense, dude. The thief, the thief special because it boosts your agility, speed, and luck, and luck can only go up by one point each time you level. So technically, that's uh, that's. A 10 level bonus instead of 10 point bonuses to anything else those can go up by five um, uh, each time you level so it's like a two level boost on agility and speed and a 10 level boost on luck the thief's fucking bonkers if you're trying to max out a character all hundreds in your stats I think I might just do the mage um, the lady's kind of nice, 10 points to willpower and endurance, but like 50 points to my ma magicka is kind of like a 25 point boost to intelligence. Yeah, we'll do the mage and, and we can change it later. Uh, mage works for now. The signs I read show the end of my path. My death, a necessary end will come when it will come. Willpower does raise Magicka recovery. But Magicka, once I can once I get to some high, high enough stats and Today get some, mage shall get some spell stuff on the screwed around with I can make some ridiculous things. My dreams grant me no opinions of success. Their compass ventures not beyond the doors of death. But in your face, I behold the sun's companion. The dawn of Akatosh's bright glory may banish the coming darkness. With such hope, and with the promise of your aid, my heart must yeah, be yeah, satisfied. Yeah. It does. Yeah. No trophies of my triumphs precede me, but I have lived well, and my ghost shall rest easy. Men are but flesh and blood. They know their doom, but not the hour. In this, I am blessed to see the hour of my death. That's also face true. My um, apportioned fate, then fall. You can wait an hour, and it I recovers all grave. your health and A tongue all your mana and all, and all that music stuff. Calls me. You shall follow me yet for a while. Then we must part. But, uh... You may as well make yourself useful. Carry that torch and stick close. Oh, yeah. We're the Emperor's bodyguards. Our job is to get him out of situations like this. <laughs> God. Although I admit, things are not going according to plan. My job is to make sure the Emperor gets out of here alive, and I intend to do it. Best of luck, man. Best of luck. Stick close and let us do our job. Um... But yeah, the, uh, the big thing that I'm planning to do is, uh... Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's 100% um, the stealth power level mechanic. Is you, like, just you could walk into a wall right here. As long as there's people somewhere near you, your stealth just levels. Yeah, yeah. These guards are choice, dude. It's also extra funny, like, 
something strange, a weird detail here is whenever you look at these guys, it's Mythic Dawn hood and Mythic Dawn robe. Like, you... You seem to know who the Mythic Dawn are. This is just a normal robe and hood. Um, but in, in game, lore-wise, there's no indication of who these people are. And, like... Well, not lore, but like, people don't know who they are. Even the Blades are trying to figure out who these people are. Um, who these assassins are, or what group they belong to. Um, so it's, it's strange to see them, like, actually show up as specifically what their title is. Though most people in Tamriel don't know that they exist or what they're doing. I don't like this. Let me take a look. Yeah, you take a look. I'm gonna power level my acrobats. Oh, hush. Looks clear. Come on. Yeah, Almost super clear, dude. Did someone actually come out of here? Probably. That is true. Um, yeah, just to <laughs> the gate is barred from the other side. A trap. Uh, what about that side path? A trap. Worth a try. Let's go. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. I, the protagonist, he he was involved with Glarthir, man. That was what it was. <laughs> and they know they both know too much. Don't see any good options here. They're behind us. Wait here, sire. Yeah. Wait here with the emperor. Guard him with your life. Yeah, you got it, boss. Here, yeah, let's see. Yep. Don't don't even worry about it. I have I've never been here before in my life. I can go no further. You alone must stand against the prince of destruction <laughs> and his mortal I've no, I haven't done. He I must done not this. have the amulet of kings. Take the amulet. Give it to Joffrey. He alone knows where to find my last son. Find him and close oh, shut oh, the jaws the of oblivion. Explicit, whatever. Oblivion. I got you. I, I'll, I'll save you. Oh, uh, well, I tried. <laughs> Just slowly pushes me out of the way. <laughs> oh, I am close to death, aren't I? Okay. Well. Somebody kill him. Thanks, guys. We failed. I failed. The blades are sworn to protect the emperor. Now he and all his heirs are dead. Yeah, you guys didn't do the quite a bang up job. Of kings. It wasn't on the emperor's body. Yeah, he gave it to me, Strange. dude. He saw something in you. Trusted you. They say it's the dragon blood that flows through the veins of every septum. They see more than less always up. The is he always awake? Is, is a that, is of that the, the thing? Most people think of the red dragon crown, but that's just jewelry. The amulet has power. Only a true heir. Because I know um. Wear it, they say. He must have young it young scrolls love young he scrolls. They they're, they're yeah. <sighs> he he gave. He gave it to me. He handed it to me. I swear. Nothing I ever heard about. But Joffrey would be the one to know. He's the Grand Master of my order. Although you may not. Yeah, Young Scrolls made a hot album. Boris Rappin. Oh, good stuff. Good stuff. Megan calls him my speak and spell rap. First, you need to get out of here. Through that door must be the entrance to the sewers, past the locked gate. That's where we were headed. It's a secret way out of the Imperial City. Or it was supposed to be secret. It sure yeah, was, wasn't we'll it? We'll need this key for the last door into the sewers. There are rats and goblins down there. But from what I've seen of you, I'm guessing you're an experienced archer. Are you All fucking right? Archer? I shot a fucking bucket. That was the only... F oh my god. You fuck... Ha, ah, never mind. Magic. Um... Yeah. 
Let's do intelligence and willpower. Normally, I would put a plus five into my luck because extra luck's always huge, but, um, but I ain't doing that this time. And no one ever puts plus five into personality. That's even if you're role playing a really nice guy. <laughs> It's it's such a garbage stat because illusion is the only thing that's like really good in personality other than like sure mercantile is fine or whatever but it it's illusion and illusion is affected not at all by personality it's infe it's affected by intelligence and willpower you basically just bypass it okay now this is the hard part I gotta choose my seven skills that I'm not going to use. Um, Probably won't block. Uh, block mm, blocking might actually be useful for some circumstances. I definitely won't use blunt um, or hand to hand. Uh, I can get away with not using light armor. Uh, and definitely no speech craft. No security. Uh, how many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. I could just not sneak because technically I could just cast chameleon 100%. Ah, man. A lot of these. Are, oh, wait. Marksman. Of course. Marksman, dude. Who needs to touch bows? There we go. So now I can sneak still and be fine. Uh, that should be good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see, uh... Sneak it. Dude. True. Sky. Knows, knows the animation for sneak hand-to-hand. -hand. Um... Ah, uh, shoot. What's a what's a good what's a good name? For, I'm bad at naming things. Something that's a pun on level one. Um. That's it, dude. Level none. <laughs> Love it. I'm into it. Here, I'll I'll actually make it a little bit better. Here we go. But, oh, is that the level, is that the, is that the cap on, it is, wow, I can't, I can't do capital, I can only do lower, fine, there it is, okay, yeah, intelligence, willpower, Matt, I don't know why it just keys up that image, these images are like, Wild, by the way. I I don't. I don't. There's so many of these that I just don't remember at all. Also, uh, a quick thing. Um, if you are doing a lot of leveling, and say you want to be a warrior, uh, if you pick the class, then your blade blunt and hand to hand, along with heavy armor, armor and block, are all in your major skills. Um, meaning that you specifically, um, you have to put 10 points in your major skills to level, and then your favorite attributes are strength and endurance. You want to level those two things. Each time you level, um, if you put 10 points into strength skills, you get plus 5 in strength. If you put 10 skip points into endurance skills, plus 5 into endurance. You can't put 10 points into both of those because all the skills from both of those things are on there. You can't get plus 5s in them. Um, so it actually makes the game harder for you to be a warrior. But I'm going to be level 1, really? so it doesn't matter. I would never have guessed. Still, I don't think you'll have any trouble with rats and goblins. You must get the amulet to Joffrey. Take no chances, but proceed to Wayne in Priory immediately. Got it? Yeah, yeah, Good. I got it. 
The Emperor's trust was well placed. Never, never been here before. I, I'll I don't. stay here to guard the Emperor's body and make sure no one follows you. <laughs> you better get moving. May Talos guide you. Yep, By yep. the way, thanks for recovering Captain Renault's sword. I'll see that it is given a place of honor in the halls of the Blades. What? Are you serious? Bitch! I don't remember that happening. Motherfucker. Took my damn sword. Yeah, you're you're welcome. It's gonna add like all the DLC quests to my log immediately. Well, at least I kept a steel short sword. Oh no. Yeah, what was their problem? That was unlocked all along. Dude really did jack my sword. What the hell? I know, I did steal it fair and square. I pulled it off his friend's body and he's just like, Oh wow, thanks for that. Jerk. All these all these quests are like... Hey, this. I I do like this, uh, this house. Um, this is for... Uh, I, a specifically very evil character. This is the house I will be getting, Frostcrag Spire. That's that's the big, that's the good stuff. I'm gonna have to make a ridiculous amount of money off that guy, but that's fine. He's got plenty of cash. I haven't actually looked at that other house, Battlehorn Castle. I haven't, I haven't looked into that one. But yeah, um, Frostcrag Spire has a has a way to make spells. And making spells is always going to be busted. Um, good stuff, though. Good stuff. Get out of here. Alright. Let's just fucking cast Flare at you. Gotta boost my destruction. Well... Shoot. Ah. Jerk. I'm actually not going to do the scroll item dupe. I'm going to go to um, uh, Dorian and paralyze him. Um, Dorian, uh, he, for some reason, has a negative amount of money. I think it's because, like, it seems like he should be a commoner, but he's wearing upper-class clothes. So it's almost like he's in debt, but the you can bribe him to raise his disposition um, and fill up his pocket with money, basically. Um, then paralyze him and pickpocket him. <laughs> okay, before I leave the sewers... How did... Hold on. Ah, uh, and yes, I have 502 saves on my other one. I don't overwrite my saves because I could break my game at any moment. <laughs> That's how Oblivion works. Isn't that so much fun? Um, why is it auto-saving? I don't like that. I don't want auto-saves. Whatever. Um, I guess I'll deal. Okay. Yeah, you can bribe him, paralyze him, pickpocket him, and the money just stays. And you can just keep clicking the money to get the money <laughs> that stays in his inventory forever. Um, I think mage is a fine enough birth sign. I, I'm not willing to take a big weakness to magic for an extra 50 mana. But the extra 50 mana at first is nice. In the class, I think is fine. Um, should be good. And if not, that's why I made the dang save in the first place. Yes, yes. More things, more things. Okay. Woo! Swimming! Yeah! 
I missed this, by the way, whenever I was playing Skyrim. Didn't, didn't miss dying, though. I drowned. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. Oh man, really? That counts to save 503? Uh, I was hoping it would make a new, like, save number list. Back outside. Yeah, I went from fine to dead in no time at all, dude. Honestly. Although you can't cast range spells underwater. I think as soon as they hit the water, they ceased ranging. Especially since they kind of muck up the water look. Yeah, look at this guy, dude. I'm ready for anything, probably. Wait, you're already draining my- what is wrong with these people? Holy crap! Good lord, dude. These people already have lug drain potions and shit? Good god. Christ. I need to jack up my skills fast, man. That is one uh, tough part is the fact that all of the skills that I'm actually using are going to be much lower than the skills that I'm guaranteed to not use, specifically. Um, so I'm probably going to be uh, training up a lot of my, uh, a lot of my spellcaster skills, um, by just, like, casting restoration on myself a bunch or whatever. I gotta get a little bit of money from here. Oh, come on, dude. Jeez, you had, like, a friggin' truck. You menace. He's gonna follow me, but that's fine. At least I can get outside. Ah, oh, This sucks, dude. At least my heavy armor is going up quick. I need an on-touch destruction spell. Lower the mana cost on that bad boy. At least my magic still does plenty of damage. Just the classic flare. Once my destruction goes up, it won't cost most of my mana to do it. Already gone down by a point. Ugh, jeez. Forgot how unforgiving it is when you're using only minor skills to do things. How dare you dodge me? It's not cool. I should hotkey this. I should have read the manual. Okay. Cool. Lots and lots of traps. Woo! It is kind of nice that you don't have to equip the spells like instead of a weapon or a shield, you can just cast them. But it's a little sucky that, uh, that you have to switch your spell every time you want to cast something different. You can't hold two spells at once. 
I probably don't have boots yet. Sweet. And, uh... Ditch that. Also, if you try and equip the Amulet of Kings, you can't. You can't equip the Amulet of Kings. Eh. None of these guys have heavy armor. It's all light armor. Can't use any of that. Yeah, give me those destruction skill boosts. That's what I need. I could also use restoration skill boosts, actually. Give me those, too. Okay, ought to be some stuff up here that I need to loot. Oh, shoot. I meant to show you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here. So while you're crouching, pull on my fists. Huh. Oh, it's because my stealth skill isn't high enough. That's right. Anyway, when your stealth skill's high enough, you do, like, this weird, um jab yeah funnel these bad boys out of here for a little boost to my income or if you feel like using them those stones will refill your mana but I could use the money a little bit more so I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna try and get through this ow man what is with all you draining my damn luck I'm already only at 50 luck anyways. Actually lowering my skills. Oh, whoops. Gotta stay topped off. Jeez. These guys can beat me up, man. Uh. Wow, you are not taking much damage from my flares. I wouldn't think you, uh, could resist magic this well, lady. There we go. <laughs> Pretty unlucky of... <laughs> My god, dude. Hell yeah, though. <laughs> Honestly. Oh, wow. Good good miss and also good noticing the fireball. Whoosh past you. Ah, oh, jeez. There we go. How much does my flare cost now, anyway? Dang. Still 13 and 16, really? Well, I guess my restoration did drop it down by a mana point. The only skills unaffected by luck are athletics and acrobatics. Um, which coincidentally are also the only skills that actually help when they're above 100. Stop blocking me. But yeah, pretty much the only the only big problems are uh, the first one being making a bunch of money, uh, which isn't really a huge problem. Like I said, it's oblivion; it's not hard to. And and like uh, Sky pointed out, um, there's a uh, there's the scroll glitch. There's also um, Dorian. Uh, there there's there's so many ways to make ridiculous money. Um, even at level one, which it's a little harder because at high levels you just start, everyone drops a Daedric Dagger and 
you just funnel those for tons of coin. Jeez. These locked doors, man. Need to buy some open, very easy lock spells whenever I get to town. Wrong spell, that's fine. The second big one is that uh, a lot of a lot of the Daedric quests, or well, all of the Daedric quests are level locked. Um, if you are not level two, then you can't do any Daedric quest, um, except for one, where if you just murder someone. <laughs> then you're all good. Uh, but the person that I have to murder is actually an unleveled character. Most most of the um, most of the enemy types in the game will level alongside your character to continue to present a challenge or whatever. Uh, shit sucks. This one doesn't. It's they're, they're just level 50 always. They'll always be level 50. Whether you get there at level 1 or level 100. Which it makes it unfortunate that I'm going to get there at level 1. But if I murder them, I can bypass the whole quest and still get a Daedric Artifact to sacrifice. Ow, jeez, dude. I know you're slow as dirt, but like, I didn't think you'd do that much friggin' damage. Gosh, man. You guys kinda stomp me. I'm a little weak at the moment. Yep, grab that. I should make sure to save in case I die in here. Which is a likely possibility. It's nice that, um, it's nice that at least my spells level up quite a little bit faster thanks to the, um, focus on magic. Hmm. Restoration will be good. Got a little bit of XP and security, but, uh, you know, that's fine. That's whatever. Not enough for me to level, so... That's what counts, dude. That's what counts. Oh no, could this possibly be a trap? Wow, look at that. <laughs> I love those traps. This huge room traps. It's so good. It's extra funny when the, all the enemies trigger them and they just keep falling. How's my weight? Weight's also gonna kind of suck until I get some decent feather spells. Okay. But alteration can take care of a lot of other skills, really. Honestly, just being a mage in Oblivion, like. It's ridiculous, dude. You can do everything. In Skyrim, it's like you're you're kind of on the same power level as everyone else, except stealth archers. Stealth archers, you'll never be more powerful than. I mean, that's just it's just how that's just how Skyrim works, you know. But uh, but here. With, with spell creation, mages can do anything. It's 
fucking cool. I love spell creation, and I wish it was in Skyrim, and I'll probably mod it in at some point when I stop forgetting to do that. Um, I mean, I want to play a base game right now because there's something about playing stuff vanilla. Oh no, it's a room with so many buttons. I've definitely never been here before, guys. Let's be real. I've, I've never seen this place before in my life. Um, pretty sure that, uh, that this is all new to me. Uh, pretty sure I haven't played Oblivion before, really. I mean, you know. Definitely not. Couldn't be me, dude. Couldn't be me. Get some more healing potions. Might as well, since I'm here. You gonna jump at me? They always jump at me. Gosh, dude. They just deal so much damage. My armor must be really busted up, actually. Yeah, I, it's degrading pretty quickly since I'm a novice in heavy armor. Yeah. Next. Doesn't matter what order these are done in. They're all just traps except for that one. Which, if you look around at all the things, once you figure out that pressing the button opens a sidewall, it's it's not it's not difficult to figure out that the ones with the shadows bouncing off of them have skeletons in them, and the one that doesn't have anything like that isn't a skeleton. But, I don't mind the extra destruction XP right now. It's helping me out. Restoration though, like, I can just cast that. I don't have to actually heal points of my health for it to count as XP. Each cast is its own set XP gain. I think destruction, you still have to strike an enemy with it, but the struck cast is the XP rather than it being the amount of damage you deal. It's still 16. 12, it's got, flares gone down to 12. It's solid. How much mana do I have? have actually it's a good question 210 dude 210 that's good level that's a good level one mana pool I like that gimme I need that thing gotta get to that thing yeah this is the Varla Stone, and uh, I don't really need it, um, but it gives me um, it gives me a bunch of money, which is what I'm after, and also is uh, can be helpful later on um, for recharging weapons, but. Uh, in, you know, you can use it to recharge weapons in the middle of a dungeon. It's pretty nice. I thought it was like a super special item the first time, and I just never used or did anything with them, because I was like, whoa, a thousand? That's crazy. It's got to be something super good. Someone's probably going to want this thing. Eh, not particularly. Take that, because I'm gonna need that for stuff. I forgot there was this whole other section with all these friggin' traps. <sighs> really need to buy some alteration spells. Better save in case one of these traps get me. Always be saving, dude. 
Ah, uh, hello. I'm just warming up. My endurance? No, I need that. Dude, the ragdoll on that. Beautiful. <laughs> Take your ring. Man. That blast back, though. That was beautiful. Oh, hey. Sweet. I don't really need them. Yeah, I'm going to need that key. Undelivered letter. Oh, Luke, my friend, I apologize. I have not written before now and pray that you worry not. How could you have known that your patrol would stumble across my outing at the cemetery? There was no denying my deed. A sack full of limbs and grave soil still fresh on my boots. With your men standing by, what choice was there but pursuit, lest they suspect your own true nature? Truly, I am glad it was you to expose me and not another whose spellfire may not have missed my escape so widely. My new haven provides safety and bodies to work on. Whether these long dead or hapless bandits, I will be content here for some time. Though I dare not yet say where. Care for... Kasu, Kasu, whoever the hell, Ko, Kosu, Ka, Kasu, know that when the time comes I shall return to live again in our beloved Daggerfall. Till then, Captain Cardius remained vigilant and always hidden Jalbert. Maybe that would have been a really cool bit of lore, but I don't know anything about Daggerfall. Unfortunate. Honestly, I don't know anything about, uh, about anything except um, Oblivion and Morrowind, really. Or Oblivion and Skyrim. I haven't... I tried playing Morrowind for, like, ten minutes, dude. It uh, didn't work out. Did not work out for me. Not that Morrowind's a bad game. Obviously, if I'm... If I could put up with Oblivion, I could probably put up with Morrowind, but, like... Just having such low luck and swinging and not hitting things. Not because I don't actually hit things, but because, like, my luck's too low for me to be able to hit things. Just sucks. Alright. Now we go to town and sell the spoils. One other thing I liked about it, I like about Oblivion is, like, you got thrown in jail... Um, for Skyrim, you know, you're crossing the border, you are an immigrant into Skyrim, you don't know the cities, you don't know the towns, but in Oblivion, you know the towns, you know the cities, you can really travel to Frostcrag Spire immediately. And Deep Sky, wow, I didn't even realize that. Huh. Yeah, I never, um... Wild, dude. I never knew you could just travel to the DLC houses too, but you could travel to all the you fast travel to all the main cities right out of the gate because like you've probably lived here, or at least you are you know the area well enough to get arrested here. <laughs> yeah, I gotta train up that acrobatics, guys. I'm going to sell my stuff over here. This guy's probably selling things illegally, but it doesn't matter. What kind of deal can I make for you today? Because he is a grand old what Have else? A look around. You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. See, look at that. Two, two bucks for most of this stuff. Wait, I should use that spell book first. Goodbye. Oh, do 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 do. Oh. Huh. Destruction? There's a novice. Wow. Hey. That ain't bad. Please come again. What kind Honestly, that's a pretty cool spell. Can I interest you in some of my wares? Yeah, yeah. Let's see if I can get away with that. An excellent. Bargain. Excellent. Good stuff. Yeah. Get this crap out of my inventory because I don't need it. Not gonna use it. 
Get a bit of gold off that staff. A good. That's more. Is there That's an easier way to do this? I forget. Probably not, though. I don't really need these scrolls. That's more. Ah, oh, the soul gems, right. I'm probably going to have that's, a tough time that's with... A um, oh, could probably just sell them all. Yeah, why not? I'm probably going to have a tough time with... Uh, I won't be able to do a very good job um, enchanting items. Well, there we go. Mercantile skill Goodbye. is already boosted up, dude. Don't need to go to first edition. Speak. Let's see here. Uh, yes. I can also loot all these things, get some extra repair hammers. I didn't. I was. I was smart and didn't put armor on my majors. Yes, so I can actually use some repair hammers. And now I need more hammers. Time to look through these crappy crates. Yeah, lock picks are pretty free. Yeah, I'll probably grind some of the skills uh, off camera just because, like, it's just going to be me casting the same spell like 80 times in the same spot. 80 is an understatement, but you know what I mean. You, why you? I'm Irene Metric. If you needed to know more, you'd already know. You look weird, dude. The feedback isn't fancy, but it fills you up. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Oh my God! Pick up the repair hammer. There we go. Knew you could do it. I knew you had it in you. Yeah. Oh, well, good enough. Got his new merchandise. Three brothers. What is it now? I need What's Edgar's discount spells. Here there were some goblins around here recently. Awesome. Here we go. Your staves. There it is. Ah, sweet. Another repair hammer. Excellent. Is that a silver nugget? I wasn't even looking for that. I... That's wild. Um, losses nearby. Increases nursing healing costs by 400%. <laughs> All right. What spells Edgar you got, Batrine. boss? Let's do business. Oh. What can I get? What can I <laughs> Just fucking absorb a merchant's mercantile. I do need ease burden big time. Can I haggle you down at all? Maybe a little bit. Please just sell it to That's me for a little reasonable. cheaper. Fuck you. You rat bastard. There we go. Okay, cool. Um... Shocking touch is fine. And burning touch is the same thing, but you know, I I need a light spell for illusion just to train it up. Um, protect would be good to train my alteration, and then life detection would be good to train my mysticism. I can already try. I could. Huh. Yeah, as far as conjuration goes, I could probably train that by just making a conjuration training spell. Um, that murky taste was funny and 
I should be able to make one. But if not, I'll go ahead and buy that. Okay. Yes, yes. Now, um, who can sell me a Paralyze Illusion spell? I actually don't know where I can buy that. Where's your friend who sells the spells? You're in Rin. Yeah, yeah, you don't sell spells. Where's your friend? So he's right here. Is it? Is it nighttime? No. She usually is here. Beg a favor of you. Hey, stranger, can you spare a few coins? I've just been shaken down by that bastard watchman, and he took my last septim. Uh, what the about that? Bastard took every coin I had with me. I don't know his name, but I know his face. Ruslan and I were shopping at Jensen's when he accused us of stealing. We turned out our pockets to prove we were innocent, but he didn't care. And we had to pay the fine, or he was going to march us off to jail. Now, he's shaken down most of the shopkeepers in the market district. They're all too afraid of him to do anything. Jensen wouldn't even talk about it. Huh. Someone ought to do something about him. Yeah, someone ought to. Oh, he's that wanted criminal. I isn't he a master thief? I hear he's dangerous, too. I've heard that the beggars spy for him. I've also heard he has a giant penis. Okay, Take bye. Advice. Stay away from the watchman. Evening, Was sir. it you? There's been some terrible trouble at the chapel in Endor. All of the Bella's priests, priestesses, murdered. To Portabella. Farewell, citizen. Oh, Edgar, you and your discount spells. I'm probably going to have to go to a mage skill to get that stupid paralyzed spell. Oh my God, so much Let's take a look at... Ah. <laughs> no one saw me do that, right? Cool. Yeah, that just didn't happen. That. No, no one. Who would? Wait. Allow me to introduce myself. What the hell? My name is Jolring. I come oh, on behalf of my right. master, Umbaka. He asked me yeah, to deliver yeah, this yeah. note. I believe it is an invitation. My master is a collector of alien antiquities. It has come to his attention that you recently sold an item that interests him. Yeah. I believe the note will give you all the details. All right, all right. Wow. I like the fucking scowl. You could tell their disposition to... Whatever. Yeah, I got it. You shouldn't have three tutorials for your fucking minigame. Um, you could tell their disposition by how uh, fucking grumpy they look whenever they're stationary and looking at Farewell. you. Good stuff, dude. Good stuff. And, uh, and you know, most people just will hate you, uh right off the bat based on the fact that you are not of the same race as they are <laughs> racism's real in tamriel people honestly it's real everywhere but you know whatever yes yes huh weird welcome to yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you got a good, uh, do you got a good spell? Wares. Um, give me that open very, can I haggle with you? Oh, man. Give me the open very easy lock. Come I on, 45 gold. Back. Fuck you, you bastard. I gotta do 170% value. Fine. Uh, tch, 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 tch. A pleasure. Yeah, yeah. Be seen. You have spells too, right, lady? What? Yeah, yeah, you have Can spells. Can I you in some of my wares? Um, ah, oh, I really, really want Beast of Burden. It's good stuff, but it's also really fucking expensive. Um, Paralyze. Ew. 
2,650 gold and 579 mana cost for a basic 10 second paralyze on touch. Fucking Christ. Ugh. Good day. That's a little high for my taste. A little high. Oh well. Some other time, maybe. Some other time. I didn't figure I'd be able to solve my money problems uh, first first stream there. Um, I am going to take a quick break. Hmm. I will do a save. And we're just going to cross our fingers and hope that game doesn't break I, I when I alt tab we'll see what happens though because I'm kind of assuming that it'll break when things happen and when I do literally anything honestly oh right I hit fucking caps lock because that's how you toggle sprint I've been sprinting everywhere by the way that's that's we fucking did. sprinting it's kind of crazy really uh, we're doing we're doing introvert again I like introvert screw it be back. start to stir Feel like i'm in a dream and i'm feeling so concerned but i don't see the issue other than i miss you introvert craving connection with you painting my emotions like a vivid symphony expressing myself through these thoughtful melodies i leave my reality to set my mind at ease i out of my shell think about you constantly living in my head for free while i keep falling under your Things are emotional, you're not feeling sociable, condition non-negotiable, connections not disposable. In my room, I draw colors flowing from my heart. Emotions bloom as I dive into my world of art. Words that said, buried beneath my silence, introvert struggling. my emotions like a vivid symphony expressing myself through these thoughtful melodies i leave my reality to set my mind at ease I'm out of my shell think about you constantly living in my head for free while i keep falling under your spell on me by your side i feel alone never have to be alone again Well, it probably broke, but I don't know that yet, oh, that's right. so you can make the now. let's try and open it back up. <gasps> Whoa, it's... I don't think it broke. Crazy, oh, dude. That is some wild stuff. All right, so um, we're going to get a Daedric Artifact if we're going to do this main quest here. And I don't know if uh, any of my spells are actually good enough for me to beat this guy. Because, eh. Huh. That seems so dumb. Like, why would you... Why a on a target? I don't... That's wild. Um, 
three points for that. Costs a lot of mana for something that isn't really great. Player does say that's 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 pretty good mana. Um, mana use for that. Fine with that one. I'll uh, key that up for my third hot key. Um, I don't really need starlight or anything. Okay, cool. Also, hello, Autumn. MC Autumn in the house. Boys and girls, boys and squirrels. Say hello to stream, Autumn. Oh, you're quiet now, huh? Now that I'm asking you to speak and say hi. Now you're... Now you go all quiet, now you don't want to talk anymore? Aw. Don't even want to sit on my lap? No, Autumn doesn't want to be it. She's too cool for Oblivion. Oblivion's too old for her. You know? My goodness. Alright, so we've got to get a Daedric Artifact to beat this main quest. And if we're getting a Daedric Artifact... Then, let's see. Then we gotta get to Vin. We gotta get to Vin Diesel. All right, we gotta find Vin Diesel. Uh, it's gonna be southwest here. Oh. I could just use the bridge like a normal person. That's fine. Oh, hell yeah. Get on over here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Autumn is not my hype cat. That's for damn sure. <laughs> uh, she, she is very much the kind of cat that's like, you know, I love you, but I don't want you to know that. Like, if you could just stay within arm's reach, but just out of reach, that would be perfect. Isn't that right, Autumn? Nope. She definitely agrees, I'm sure. <laughs> All right. One of the, one of the, uh, hello. Yes, I know you want pets, you cute nerd. Why won't you get in my lap or something? Somewhere where it's a little easier for me to give you pets. Um, but yeah, Vin, Vin Diesel. Uh, family is only. It's only a little further over here. I think it's actually this one I'm coming up on now. Um, unless I'm wrong. Could, could obviously be wrong. There's a good chance. And I gotta hit this Aelid Ruin and, uh, and get Umbra. A, a great cursed sword from Yor. Um, I believe Umbra was also featured in Morrowind. But, uh, but this version... That's this is not this is not the place. This is not where I thought it was. But uh, I believe the Morrowind version you could like upgrade and let. Are you fucking si I th the fog of war just lifted on you, dude, and you're already fucking shooting me with arrows. What the hell is your problem? Wait, where's? I muted the game. I muted the game. That's why I couldn't hear anything. Right. Right. I muted the game, guys. I muted the game. That was that was me. Crazy bastard. Just got out of the fog of war and he's already fired a fucking shot at me. Christ. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead. Heal up again, then. Uh, it's so relaxing though. I the the discovery um 
mean, of course, I'm discovering something that's pretty old at this point, but... Yeah. But it's still really nice. Like, I love the Radiant AI in this game. Um, it, it was it was pretty revolutionary, and there were there were so many things that it broke, um, which is fascinating. Like that they kept it. Um, they didn't give up on it. They they tweaked it until it was like, okay, this is at the point where it makes the world feel alive and also it's uh and also it doesn't impede the player uh at least not too much i guess because like because like i i do like skyrim a lot um obviously put a ton of hours into it um, and, and I like Oblivion. Honestly, um, if I were to call it, I'd say Oblivion, but the, I like spreadsheets. I like doing math. I like, here we are, Vin Diesel. And there's an imp, bad aim, I'm so good at this game. No, I'm not, it's fine. Ow, jeez. How do you hurt me so much by fucking elbowing me when your fireballs don't deal that much damage? Yeah, keep throwing fireballs and wasting your mana. Yep, yep. Good aim there, champ. Oh, he's coming at me. Jeez, dude. Ah. Okay, and, uh, good time to dump some of those potions I've been hoarding, huh? Did I get it? Oh, there you go. There you are. Cool. Yeah, I, um... I really like both games, obviously. Um, I just, it feels a little more personable when you walk up to someone and they're not like, oh, I work for Bellathor at the general goods store, when they're like, hello, and then they greet you based on how much they like you, because like, if they hate you, they're gonna be like, do you really have to talk to me? <laughs> and if they like you, they're like, hey, good to see you again. Um, yeah, yeah, that that is true. Like, um, there's uh, oh crud. I this place has a lot more. Tr oh yeah. I had my acrobatics trained up last time I was here so I could actually jump on top of these things, but now I... Now I'm... Short jump. Bye! Oh my gosh. <laughs> uh, Oblivion definitely, uh... Is much more on the side of, of RPG. With its, uh, with the fact that it's heavily stat based, stuff like that, um, I think, I mean, I, I want to call Skyrim more balanced, but it's, it's not really, neither one's particularly well balanced, um, I know, I know about you, don't. Don't even, don't even screw with me like that. Um, and as much as I, to, I haven't played Starfield. I can't, I can't comment on Starfield. You're out of your mind, stealth archers. But mage is so good in Oblivion. 
You're out of your gourd. I can make a spell that gives me 500 mana and then does a bunch of other stuff with that 500 mana it just gave me. But yeah, like, I, I just, I just like Oblivion. If I, and there, there we go. Okay. This is the person. Um, hmm. Now I didn't think this through particularly well because there's no real way for me to for me to murder this person, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. There's not really a way for me to do it. Where, what's my stat boost right now? Personality, right. That was Debella's altar. Mm, that's gonna help me out tremendously here. Um. So I don't really have a way to deal, uh, and I say much damage, but it's any, basically any damage here. Um, so this That's may, uh, <laughs> super, super, honestly, it, in Oblivion, it's like, if someone gets shot, they are chasing you to the ends of the fucking earth, um, until they get fucking revenge. They'll chase you out of a dungeon, by the way. They will leave the dungeon to go and kick your ass. Um... <laughs> wow, what perfect fucking timing. Oh, oh my god. The fire, frost, and lightning have flowed from your fingertips. You are now an apprentice in destruction magic and can cast apprentice level destruction spells. Now, here's my big problems. First off, she's level 50. Um, she's probably gonna one Yep. Basically a one tap on me. Okay, that's awesome. Yep. I'm dead. Okay. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um. So, the biggest problems are, first off, the fact that she can two-shot me. Uh, second, the fact that, um, I can't do a lot of damage to her at once. And she and she specifically um, has a health regen keyed into her character. Um, it's not a lot, but it's enough that uh, like a lot of the first level junk can't really hurt her. Um, so like I can cast fireball and I can hit her with fireball, but. Um, it's only doing six points of damage, um, and she can't take, like, if I'm not doing a certain amount of damage per second, then she's not really taking damage, um, she's just having, having a good time, you know. Uh, let me actually, I should put this on a hotkey. I'll put it on eight. It can be it can be pretty far out of reach and it's not gonna bother me too bad. And uh Stealth Archer would work if I had enough acrobatics actually. Um if I train up acrobatics, uh then um Stealth Ar or, or or archery in general. Even blade uh works as long as I have a blade that has a longer reach than hers. Then I'm fine. Um, and that sword uh, actually has the highest damage in the game. Or is tied for the highest base damage uh, short sword in the game. Or maybe just blade. I, th I think it's uh, highest DPS or something. But one blade has an enchantment on it and the other doesn't and you're gonna fucking you're really gonna play me like that dude listen 
I don't know if this counts as a murder, but like it probably shouldn't because you're running after me. Yeah, I'm sure you were probably going to talk to me and be like, all right, hand over your stuff. Oh, it was so sad. The other day, I was playing on my, was playing on my beefy character. And there was this bridge, and I don't remember where it was. I think it was down close to uh, Bog Marsh, um, where, um, where what what is it? Deep Scorn Hollow is, uh, below Leowen. Yeah, somewhere around here. There's a little bridge, um, and I I can't remember where exactly it was, uh, but. I I killed some troll or a bandit on top or no I think it was a bandit I killed some bandit on top of it and then looked under the bridge and there was a poorly scribbled note and a dead body of a troll with the poorly scrawled note and um, cheap wine on it uh, and it uh, and it um, the poorly scrawled note was like, no one's giving me money, I'm not good bridge troll, gonna get drunk and, gonna get drunk and off myself. And he was just laying face down with his cheap wine. My god. I was, I was like, no fucking way, dude, like, this poor, this is the most I've ever felt for a bridge troll. Oh my gosh. Oh crud. Who's who's on me? It's you? Okay. Good aim, dude. Good aim. Doing great. Oh man, are you gonna hit me? No. Nope. Your arrows are really slow in this game. Oh, oh, you almost you almost got me. You almost got me that time. There we go. <laughs> oh, that was fun. That was good stuff. <laughs> good times, dude. Good times. Okay, I don't really want you to get close to me, but it doesn't matter. It will be nice not really having to worry about uh, a lot of the bandits or creatures because like they're gonna be level one which is you know it is expected that your spells and stuff will be of level one but I'm gonna hit I'm gonna hit a hundred and a lot of this stuff pretty quickly for now I will head up to Frostcrag Spire and show off the home that I'm eventually gonna have obviously not right now I did not plan two hours of stuff pre-level grinding because, uh, I just love this game. I could fucking walk around and do fuck all in this game for so long and not even care, but I realized I should make progress. This is Frostcrag Spire, by the way. Just look at this beaut. I got some walls where it feels like we're just on the cusp of Skyrim up here right near the Jural Mountains and Sky you could look you know, right over there and see Skyrim too bad it's really foggy and this is gonna be my house dude isn't it be this fucking tower this is like Mage Guild ain't got shit on Frostcrag Spire baby this place rocks. I've got the key. Dusty tome. Let's uh, in an ice hand, dude. That's pretty cool, actually. I never, it, with all the shine, I never really noticed that it's uh, like a whole golem and his hands just coming out, showing off the tome. Yeah, yeah, I really read that tome, dude. Um, this is basically just saying, wow, look at all this cool stuff. Uh, is it really, does it really not open up at all, though? That's unfortunate. Oh, here we go. Are things happening? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. 
Look at that. Oh. It's beautiful. This, uh... Where does this take me, then? Oh. Just to a weird basement. Fancy. Yeah. It's, it's always nice to have warp pads to get to different places in your house. Uh, man, I don't even have a... Oh, wow. This is still here? That's pretty cool. Plenty of alchemy ingredients for the alchemy I won't be doing. Um, oh, wow, and I can still get on top of the place. Look at my little spinning doodad. Here. Ah. <laughs> oh. I mean, I I don't know. I love this fucking house. It's great. It's really and and also wait. Wait a minute. I don't think that that Wait. I this some of these things seem wrong because I mean in case you in case you uh, didn't know Kavaj is uh, having trouble right now that's why I can only go over here and this is counted as Kavaj so it's strange to see that I can do this travel portal doesn't seem right also it's you know what let, let, let's see where this takes me it may just take me to the opening, uh, the, the entrance hall. Yeah, I do. okay. It just sends me over here. Yeah, that makes sense. Because, um... Because uh, you aren't allowed to go into the college, which is the place that you can create spells for free, or not the college, the Arcane University or whatever. Yeah. Uh, until you have done a Mage's Guild quest in every major city um, and gain their recommendations. And that's the only way to make, uh, make spells for free. Um, and you still have to pay for each spell you make, but uh, to make a spell in Frost Crag Spire, I first have to... Um, I first have to talk to this lady... Is she is she in the market district or is she in the palace uh, district? She is in the market district. Okay. Um, I first have to like buy a bunch of upgrades for the house. Uh, I can't just I can't just go in there and make a spell. Just like Evening. I can't just go in and enchant my gear um I, are you a beggar are you no there you are go ahead please yeah 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 mm, Bye. okay apparently i can't buy from Bye. you unless i could buy from you you know what that makes sense i uh i can understand that ah dang it i really need more repair hammers It's closed, dude. That that didn't show up, did it? Okay, cool. Good. I, uh, I was, I, I'm watching my stream so that I can see my stream in my stream chat, um, and also, like, you know, play the game on my PC. I know. What kind of ingenious is Have a look at my Such wares. a good setup. I'm sure there's something to suit you. Uh, give me some repair hammers, dude. I'll just, I'll just take ten. Ten, ten's plenty. I don't have come. a lot of weight anyway. Goodbye. Please come again. Uh, there we go. 
go. Oh, that's, that's All right, you know what? We're gonna go. We're gonna go do the rat quest. I like the rat quest. Some people are like, "Well, the rat quest." Also, Skingrad probably favorite city. It has such good quests. Good questing in Skingrad, man. That's where Glarthir is at. That's where Whodunit's at. Um, and I don't know how much I'm going to go through on on this level one playthrough. Um, I'm I'm having a great time. Like, I, I could walk around. I could do quests. I could talk about this fucking game forever. They said a, a, a Bethesda's been leaking. What can I do okay. for you? Okay, hey, hey, Azan. Yep, you're able-bodied. I love being in the guild. There's money to be made. If you'd like to join up, let me know. Yep, yep, all about it. The Fighters it. Guild is always looking for new members. If you've got a clean record and don't have a bounty on your head, we may be able to use you. I probably you don't in have a bounty on my head. I, no one saw me try and lockpick that door. Fine. You are now an associate in the Fighters Guild. For contracts, speak either with me or with Burz Grokosh in Chaden Hall. Good luck to you. There's been leaks and stuff that people are like, oh, Bethesda's doing an Oblivion remaster or remake or something. And I'm like, you're all fucking liars. But if they do. A contract for you? I think I've got um, something that suits your experience. Arvina Phyllis I am has some problems. All with rats about in the it. House. I'm so all about it. I love this game. And I'm assuming that the code is still fairly pristine for Oblivion. I, I'm assuming they kept it. Uh, because why well, I'm so stupid. I have to talk to him about the lady. I don't I don't even know who this lady is. He just told me that I have a contract. Jeez. Yes, rats. I'm sure she can explain it to you better than I. She lives here in Anvil. Go and talk to her. Good luck. All right. I got to go talk to her about her rat problem. Rat. A classic. A fighter's guild staple, really. But yeah, I, I'm maybe... Because, like, you would think they would remake Morrowind first. I don't know. I would think they would remake Morrowind first. But, like, maybe the code for Morrowind isn't... Isn't all there. Or some, something's wrong that... That they're not able to do that. Um, God, I would love a remake of this game, though. Oh. Then again, I mean, there's plenty of mods. Oh, I could have, I could have modded the hell out of this. Yes. I'm playing vanilla. Ah, but even vanilla, I love this game. You must be from the game. Fighters Guild. Good. I have mm. a problem. It has to do with the rats in my basement. Yep, yep. Here, here for the rats, ma'am. All right. That's right. Rats in my basement, and something has been killing them. It's horrible. My poor babies, you must do something. I don't know what I'd do without them. Their little pink noses, their scaly little tails. Please get to the basement and find out what's happening. Because if not, it might be invisibility, maybe? Love this crazy lady. Save magical rats. <laughs> Fucking wild, dude. This this was like the first quest I did here, and it's it's just hilarious. I love it. Like, oh yeah, we're not. We don't want you to kill the rats. We want you to save the rats from whatever's killing them. Hell yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. And I, I'm kind of with you, Bear. Um, honestly, as long as Elder Scrolls 6 is good, that'd be sweet. Um, but also, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I got the nostalgia goggles on for Oblivion, but yeah. If, if they just do a good job on Elder Scrolls 6, it doesn't particularly matter. I, I could, they don't need to remake anything. Modders are already going to do that for them, really. <laughs> Gotta be sneaking through a hole in the wall somewhere. I wonder where that could be, that hole in the wall. Wow, how could... <laughs> uh, 
Uh, you're not allowed to travel through the hole, by the way. That's not, um, that's not something you can do. You know, you know, Sky, uh, you, you've got some, you got some pretty keen insights. It's almost like you've played this game before. I wonder, I wonder when you would have had time to... <laughs> to play this. Uh, I don't even, well, I don't even remember found? what you is, Kay. Did you take care of my babies? It's, it's old, it's old. There's a, a mountain, mountain lion. lion. In my basement? But how? That's not possible, but it happened. What if there are more? What if it wasn't alone? Where there's one, there will be more. Find Pinarus and Ventius. He's a hunter and knows this area inside and out. He'll know what to do. Uh, you know, and... Go find Pinarus and those mountain lions. The, like... The like twelve voice actors they got to do all the characters in this, they, they did their best, man. Is this a young scroll? <laughs> Dude, listen, I love young scrolls. All right, that Boris album was fire. His new Glorithier album was fire. Shay Gorath's album, all of it. His songs are so fucking stupid and great. I don't know, I guess I'll save. I, I meant to wait. Because I guess it's too late for me to go into his house. Whatever, I'll just... I'll just hit it until it's 8 a.m. Everyone everyone wakes up at 8 a.m., you know what I mean? Everybody. All the shops are open at 8. That's, wh that's when the town gets bumping. I accidentally waited till. No, 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 I hit, I hit 8. It's perfect. All right. God, I'm stupid. It's upstairs, Jacob. Uh, the compass may be pointing green, but that doesn't mean it's not upstairs. There we go. Dude, you've been rocking some detect light. Those, those, your slippers are having some problems, brother. That's fine. That's fine. Inneris Inventius, hunter, woodsman, and marksman at your service. Yep, yep. Mountain, Mountain lions. lions. Here. <laughs> Odd. If they're around, I can find them. Come with me. A hunt will do us good and maybe make that old nut feel better. Let's see. Let's go hunting. Yep, let's do it. Amazing pathic. Oh man. Hell yeah, dude. Hell yeah. It's that charm, that old school charm. Hell. They call me Wilhelm the Worm. God, your because fucking dirt eyes. Suits me fine. Town lets yep. me live in the warehouse to keep out the rats. <laughs> you should not uh, you should not be in the sunlight. Farewell. Oh god. Good stuff, dude. Good stuff. Yeah, man. The old school charm. Everyone greets you when you walk by. I like I like people watching in this. That's one of the reasons I like Glarthy <laughs> Wilhelm the Bug Eye, dude. Absolutely. <laughs> uh <laughs> I, I love people watching in this because it's like you can watch someone go over and talk to somebody about some topic and they'll be like hey did you hear about this and they'll be like no I haven't heard anything about that and then they'll go up to the next person and be like hey have you heard about this and they'll be like yes I heard the chapel burned down or something and like they'll talk to each other about the things that they hear is that Mike is that Mike the liar right now no way. No way. Quick Mike. Mike yes. <laughs> Dude, hell yeah. Mike knows many things others do not. Wow, dude. Got Mike the liar. It is good the people wear clothing. Mike wears clothing. Who would want to see Mike naked? Sick, sick people. 
Very sad. That's right. That's right. <laughs> uh, do you have anything? No, no, that's all. Bye, Mike. And he is fucking out of here. Look at that. Boy, go. Uh, I'm so glad I got, to, I got to catch him. Usually he just runs so fast. Usually he is absolutely out of here. Come on. Panaris, you gotta move, dude. There's a bunch of them down here I can't open. If they're out here. Oh, also oh yeah, I wonder here. where they are. I can't imagine there are more than four of them. Let's it's take care hard, of hard to hard to really figure out where they could be. <laughs> okay. Okay. Whew. I cannot wait until my heavy armor gets better so that uh, so that I don't instantly die. It also doesn't help. Bretons actually have a pretty naturally low endurance. Maybe I should have taken the lady sign as my, as my one. Maybe that would have been a good plan, honestly. I think that'll be all of them. Can't imagine more in this area. You can go tell Arvena this is all taken care of. Good hunting. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, where, where could those be? Dang. Even murdered somebody. Oh, shit. Yeah. Give me them acrobatic skill boosts. I do like how bloody the blade is. Just the blood splatters everywhere. Even when you get hit, like, if you get hit from behind, your blood will splatter on the wall in front of you. Good stuff. Good stuff. Back when I... But the first time I played this, I would go over to a friend's house, and it was on his PS3, and I think it was his dad's game, and... Hiding Oops. Went way past the house, that's fine, I got distracted, I got caught up in my nostalgia glass, nostalgia goggles and all that stuff. Good times. Yeah, man, I... Uh, You've got to take care of those mountain lions! Damn, bitch, I'm working on it, I just did! Christ! What the hell's your problem? You think you've gotten rid of them all? You do? Well, you have. But there's one in my basement right now. Go get it. Okay, I guess that's uh, all right. That's you know what that. Okay, you know. I I guess your cause for alarm was slightly warranted, but you could have been a little nicer about it. God damn. Get zapped. Okay, good. If she ran out of rats, that would be a problem. Also, I can't. Oh, I, don't I can't see that. That's weird. Oh well. At least I could see it on uh, on other screens and stuff. Right. Like the gods you killed that thing. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Someone's out to get me to oh, get my goodbye, poor babies. Oh, oh well. it's that quill She's weave here next for a door. Minute. Quill weave. She's the one. She's never liked me or my sweet little pets. I know it's I her. wonder why I've she doesn't like you, dude. Sneaking around in back of my house at night. 
She thinks she's so smart. She and all the other women. I'll show her. All the I other want women? You to keep an eye on her. Find out what she's up to. There's a common denominator here. Just just throwing that out there. I think we're in for some hard <laughs> times. I also The death of Uriel Septim and his heirs changes everything. I do love the shift in tone when you say something that's not about the quest that you're on right now. You can't imagine the fuss some people make. God, she's just so calm. <laughs> Wow, just so calm about it. Ugh. Good stuff. Okay, let's go talk to Quillweave. Quillweave, by the way, I looked up this NPC because I looked up a bunch of stuff. I like finding out things about the, I don't know how I got that new topic, whatever. I like looking up things about this game. Quill. Greetings to you. Oh, hi. My name's Quillweed. Caught you at the exact wrong moment. stories about the lives of the lower and criminal classes. Yeah, Quillweave um, is a writer. You Between can find sailors and things that Quillweave has written in the world. Local circle of friends, um, I have plenty of yarns for nicking up my tales. Um, Quillweave will go to the docks, walk around, uh, buy uh, buy ink and pens at uh, the store every day because she never stocks up. She has to go buy new ink and new quill pens every day, a new parchment, um, and. And I love this part. Once every, um, once like every month on the seventh, she'll go and visit her friend in another city and walk alongside her friend for like a couple of days, and then walk back. It's thirty-six hour walk, and you can catch her on the road. You could see her with her friend wherever. Like, that's so cool. I like that. Like. And you wouldn't find her in this city. Not that you need her for anything, except she can train you in acrobatics. But, like, if you wanted to find her to train acrobatics... I don't even know what you're talking about. How you doing, Majestic Steve? Um... Don't do it without any proof. Um... They say that when you murder someone... You the are very right. Comes it is not Argonian. I'm playing a breath. how they recruit new members. Uh, do love Argonians, though. Good day. All right. Well, Quillweave's not gonna let up. She's not gonna. She's 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 not gonna let me figure out her dirty secret. Um. I did. I did die underwater. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Honestly, the disease... Well, I thought it was only disease resistance, but... What were you doing back there, huh? What were you, huh? What were you doing back there? That was weird, walking past the back of her house. I see how the mountain lions are getting in. Maybe patch up your damn house, lady. Jesus Christ. You got problems. All right. Let's wait a little bit longer. But honestly, like, the water breathing's kind of nice without having to wear, um, uh, without having to wear some amulet or ring that gives it to you or something. Um, it's pretty good. Uh, especially if you're training, um, yes, I know, right? I love this quest, dude. <laughs> um, because if you're training, uh, athletics and stuff, then water breathing's pretty sweet for that. Um, oh, Quill Weave, I wonder what you're doing over here. You're still not doing the thing. Okay, well, wait. Is there a helmet at the bottom of that? Huh. Dude, Majestic Steve's got my back, man. 
He members. He members. In Anvil? Really? You might be right. I the only the only things I've done in Anvil are this Fighters Guild quest, um that house. Uh that's a fun one. Um bought bought a house. It's so hard to fucking see underwater. Seeing underwater is the real trouble, dude. Good lord. Then again, this is just a lake. You could Yeah. Well, I have, I have it on this one. Um, I, like I said, I don't know how much of this I'm going to stream. I kind of fucking love it. Uh, so, I don't know, like, maybe I'll fucking do the Dark Brotherhood quests, because I like them, or, or some of the other guild quests and stuff. Um, in the actual ocean. But I did the uh, I did the haunted house in my yeah, other one. Sure. Um, oh, I wonder what 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 are you doing there? Whoa, quill weave. Hmm. It's strange that you just put a ton of meat down next to her house. Yes. What can I do for you? I just saw you, you dude. What? Well, I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. I would never go skulking about. Dude, never. Fine, you got me. <laughs> I figured if I let so, them such a quick turnaround. The little things would come out, and the guards would take care of them. Oh, for the love of God! I hope I hit the record button, or I'm going to be sad. No, wait. I can I can download this from Twitch. Twitch. Ah, uh, they saved my VOD, so I could just download it off there. Perfect, cool, I'm fine. Oh, stressing over nothing. Mountain lions? Yeah, you attracted basement? mountain lions, you crazy bitch. I just wanted to lure her vermin outside. I didn't mean to hurt anyone, except the rats. Please, don't tell her. Except the rats. And if you can keep this our little secret, I can make it worth your while. There's a bit about acrobatics I can teach you. Give it some thought. Hmm. Right, well, so well, you well. Do I tell her or not? The answer is I don't tell her because, like, I'm pretty sure she'll train me in speechcraft. This, oh, so this lady. did you follow her? She's behind it, isn't she? Tell Damn. me what you found out. Calm, fucking chill, dude. She wasn't even, she didn't do she nothing. Didn't, huh? <laughs> but you've taken care of the problem, and I suppose that's what counts. Thanks for that. Here's your payment. God damn, she sounds like I've fucking stabbed her. Oh, the poor little rats. <sighs> she wild, dude. Alright, train me in acrobatics, Quill Weave. Majestic Steve, are you a Glarthier believer? So, you didn't sell me out. I appreciate that. Well, I said I'd make it worth your while. So let me teach you a little something. You've got to be light on your feet to make it around here. And that's something I'm good at. Maybe you can be too. Take care. Oh, yeah. Bye. Yeah. What is it now? Made it worth my Let's while. Go along with you. I understand Daedra worship has become increasingly prevalent in the Somerset Isle. Wink. It seems Somerset Isle <laughs> yeah. has become a much more dangerous place. Good day. Be seeing you. Let's hear it. May I help you? I just like I just like hearing him talk about the random events and stuff happening in the world. And I especially like that when you do stuff, um like people will talk about the things that you do specifically. They'll be like, oh man, did you hear about the Fighters Guild? They did this, this, and this, or whatever. Wait, is the contract done then? I don't even have to turn it back into my superiors in the guild. It's just like, nah, you did it, dude. There you go. You're all set. I'll be back. 
Uh, what was the other thing I was going to do? I could talk to Glarthir. Why not? I love Skingred. And I'm such a sucker for this game, dude. Jeez. Can't stop. Won't stop. And I really need paralysis. My only options are find something enchanted with paralysis or be able to cast the spell. Both of those uh, are going to be problematic. Oh, I'm sure it won't be too bad later on. I guess just because it's nighttime, Glarthir doesn't care about me right now. He's probably asleep. Well, he needs to get out here. There's the boy. I'll just pretend not to see him. Nope. It just... <laughs> He's approaching me. Menacingly. Over here. Yes, you. We need to talk. Yes, you. We need to talk. <laughs> We can't talk here. Too public. Meet me behind the great chapel at midnight. Don't let anyone follow you. I'll make it worth your while. Oh, someone else making it worth my while. Hell yeah. <laughs> Alright, bye, dude. Oh, uh, what a guy. Uh, what is it, sir? What do you know about Glorithir? <laughs> Total nutcase, if you ask me. But he's never done anything yet that we could arrest him for. What are you looking for? The guilds. The guilds are inside the north walls, to the west. Also, like, no wonder. Bye. No wonder he's nuts. Uh, this place is a fortress. Look at them walls. Look at this chapel. I like the fact that each town, like, has its own kind of architecture, you know? Um, it's very influenced by the countries that border it. Uh, Skingrod's a little, like, it's built kind of vertically, really. Which is strange. It doesn't seem like it needs to be, but I guess it's in a bit of a mountainous area. Um... And it's weird that there's just, like, these canals that aren't canals. Like, there's bridges over something that obviously doesn't have water anymore. So it feels like there used to be water flowing through the town. Um, but Anvil, like, a lot of their architecture is, is Hammerfall-styled. And um, same with, like, Bruma would, would look a lot like Skyrim's architecture. Uh, and, and it's just little things like that. I, 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 I pretty, I enjoy it. I enjoy it. Ugh. I'm just kind of prattling about. I should probably stop here. I can do some, I can do some skill grinding on my own. Just need to stay away from these, which is going to be absolutely not hard. Um, and then I can start working on getting some spells in my repertoire, actually being able to do some stuff, getting some alteration where I can open uh, some more locks um, and boosting a lot of my skills to where I can get paralyzed and actually make some money. So maybe next time uh, we solve my money problem and beef up Frostcrag Spire and, uh, and grab some other quests or something. But... I think that'll be it for tonight. Go ahead and make a new 
New level one save. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks everybody for tuning in, watching me cook and play a, a super old RPG that I just really freaking enjoy. I'm, I'm probably going to be doing this for the next couple of Sunday nights for a while because, dang, I enjoy it. Good night, everybody, and I'll catch you Wednesday night playing Switch games.